Hey, do you know what the leading cause of home fires is? Stay tuned to find out. My name is Cesar Yanez and you're watching The CY Show. Today, I'm here to tell you that your pets are the main reason for house fires. <laughs> now, I'm just kidding. They're not as dumb as us, luckily. <laughs> All right, no. I'm Cesar Giannis, and today I'm here to share another great video with you. So, today, I'm gonna tell you that electrical problems are the main reason behind house fires. And I'm gonna share with you some of the most dangerous things that electricians shared that could put your home at risk. So, stay tuned. Okay, so the first thing is using adapters on two-prong outlets. You see a lot of the older homes still use these two-prong outlets which are kind of old. It's really just the outlets with the two holes instead of three. And the problem with this is that a lot of today's appliances use three-prong outlets instead of two. So instead of using adapters that can overheat, make sure to replace those two-prong outlets with three-prong outlets. Now the second thing is using devices, electrical devices on loose outlets. When you do this, this can lead to fires and I'm gonna tell you exactly how to prevent this. Just replace the loose outlets. The third thing is using the wrong extension cord outside. If you're gonna use an extension cord outdoors, make sure it's rated for outdoor use. Otherwise, it's gonna overheat and it's gonna cause a fire. This is pretty common sense. It's like if you're going outside in the hottest day of summer and you wear multiple layers, multiple sweaters and jackets, you're gonna overheat, you may get a stroke and that's not good. So don't do that. Make sure you use your extension cord accordingly. Now, the fourth thing is if your circuit's overloading. If you think your circuit's overloading, make sure to contact a licensed electrician to inquire about the replacement or upgrading of your panel. The fifth and last thing is overlooking the importance of ground fault circuits. All the outlets in your kitchen and bathroom should be equipped with these ground fault circuit interrupters. And what this means is that if any of these outlets sends water nearby, it will shut down the power completely. So, they're great devices, make sure you have them installed in your house. Now, that's all for you today. I hope this information was helpful and please follow these five tips to keep your home safe. Thank you for watching and see you soon.